Okay guys, we got one of the 100 car trains in front of us now. There she goes, guys. Okay, they just got to a crossing a good quarter mile from here. And apparently these cars might be loaded. Because I'm looking at the, the springs, they're on the axles of every car, and it looks like they're kind of being pressed down by all the, by all the weight within the, with inside the cars anyways. It'd really suck big time if any of these cars were to jump the track and fall over. This is one of two trains on the Eastern Idaho's Snake River route that even gets up to a uh, hundred cars. There's this one in front of us and uh, Another one that supposedly goes out to the ethanol plant. Both this train and the, the one that goes to the ethanol plant are usually the longest ones on the eastern Idaho Snake River route. And the rails, those hoppers are on. I'm guessing are 115 or 120 or 135 pound rails. Not welded rails, but non-welded rail joints, FYI. <laughs> 